So throughout history, there have been some ferocious creatures that have roamed the Earth, and it seems the biggest and most dangerous have since gone extinct. For this list, I won't be including very well-known animals such as the Spinosaurus or T-Rex, or for the most part, any other dinosaurs. Number 10, Gigantopithecus. This creature was a monstrous ape, closely related to the orangutan that roamed the bamboo forests, jungles, and mountains of China, India, and Vietnam during the Pleistocene time period. It was a vegetarian, but still probably not a sight for sore eyes. It could grow up to 3 meters tall and weigh up to 1,200 pounds. Its strength was undoubtedly extraordinary and probably kept it safe for most predators, and it probably would not hesitate to use its strength against a human who got too close for its comfort. It went extinct 300,000 years ago, possibly due to overhunting by early humans or as the result of climate change. Number 9, 3 foot long scorpions. Officially known as Pomanoscorpius, these creatures were very similar to today's scorpions but could grow up to a meter long and were armed with sharp claws and a venomous stinger. It's not known how deadly the venom was, but considering the large amount it injected with each attack, it was more than likely very deadly. During the time period that these things were around, there were also giant roaches the size of house cats, dragonflies the size of hawks, and millipede relatives up to 3 meters long. Number 8, Giant Crocodiles. If normal crocodiles weren't bad enough, there was once a creature now known as Purasaurus, which was more than twice the size of a regular crocodile. It lived in South America 8 million years ago, and would grow up to 13 meters long. That's more than twice as long as the largest species of crocodile alive today. It would be fully capable of swallowing a human whole. These giant crocodiles were capable of fighting T-Rexes and winning. Number 7, Quetzalcoatlus. Undoubtedly the most horrifying living thing to ever come from the sky, these creatures were gigantic predatory birds standing at about roughly the same height as a giraffe. Some of them had wingspans of 12 to 15 meters, making them as large as a small plane. What was rather strange about the creatures were their body proportions. They had ridiculously long legs, necks, and beaks, and very small bodies, as well as relatively short wings. Scientists believe that they did not hunt in the air, but rather walked on the ground hunting for any animal they could catch and swallow a whole, and that may have included dog-sized, or maybe even man-sized creatures. Number 6, Megalodon. This enormous, extinct creature is the biggest species of shark to have ever existed. It's generally thought to have looked similar to the modern Great White. However, while a Great White Shark can grow up to be 20 feet long and over 7,000 pounds, Megalodon was estimated to be 60 feet in length, weighing anywhere from 50 to 100 tons. Megalodon only died off about 2.6 million years ago. This means that he often interacted with animals that are still around today, like giant sea turtles, porpoises, and even whales. If these guys were still around, it would just be one more reason to stay out of the ocean. Number 5, Gorgonox. Before dinosaurs came along, the planet was still full of giant, horrifying monsters. A prime example is Gorgonops, an animal that lived 260 million years ago, way before the dinosaurs became the dominant predators. At around 6 to 10 feet in length, Gorgonops was such a fast and vicious predator that it quickly rose to the top of the food chain. Of course, it also helped that Gorgonops had massive canines so large they nearly protruded beyond its lower jaw. Number 4, Terror Birds. These birds were the top predators in South America and parts of North America during the Miocene, Pliocene, and early Pleistocene periods before they were replaced by big cats and other carnivorous mammals. Unlike Quetzalcoatlus, they were unable to fly, but could run very fast, some speculate as fast as a cheetah, and of course they were very large, with the largest of the species growing up to 3 meters tall and weighing up to half a ton. Their main weapon was their head, which could grow up to a meter long, allowing them to swallow prey as large as a dog in one single gulp. However, thanks to the hooked tip of the bill which was used as a weapon, the terror birds could kill and devour prey much larger than a dog, including horses, camels, and humans if they were around at the time. Number 3, Titanoboa. Being the largest snake to ever exist, Titanoboa grew upwards of 15 meters long and weighed over a ton. It lived in the warm climates of the tropics 60 million years ago. It killed its prey by squashing it like the modern boa constrictor, 
and there's pretty much nothing that thing couldn't squeeze like a tube of toothpaste. Meaning, this thing would eat you like a boa constrictor would eat a guinea pig, which is why you should be happy it's extinct. Number 2, Arthlopleura. If you've ever seen a centipede or millipede crawling through your backyard and you thought that was a whole lot of nope, or perhaps seen or heard of the giant centipede and thought those things were horrifying, then you might not want to know about the Arthlopleura, which were massive millipedes that could grow up to 3 meters long. These things had few, if any, predators, and it's not actually known whether they themselves were predators or not, but either way, odds are you would not want to run into one of these things. And number one, Mosasaurus. Fossil evidence suggests that Mosasaurus could reach as much as 50 feet in length, making it one of the largest marine predators of Earth's history. Mosasaurus' head was like that of a crocodile, lined with hundreds of razor-sharp teeth which could kill even the most well-armored enemies. Almost three times the size of the Leopleridon, which was perhaps the next most ferocious sea predator, the Mosasaurus would be capable of eating a small boat in one bite today. 